Yeah, and I mean, most of us, you know, while we probably don't all want to admit that we're spending way too long on our screens, it's kind of unavoidable in the society that we're living in. What are some of the symptoms that we should be watching out for? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, the, the symptoms that often occur, I mean, up to about 70%, there's research showing that up to about 70% of people who regularly use digital screens complain of digital screen symptoms. And this includes dry eyes and blurred vision and uh, uh, double vision and also experience headaches. So, so therefore, we wanted to look at uh, lutein and zizanthin as a treatment to help combat mm. the negative effects of uh, of electronic screen use. So we completed a double-blind placebo-controlled study, so the gold standard type of study that uh, is available, and we got half the people who were placed on placebo capsules and half placed on lutein and zizanthin. And we investigated changes in their eye health through several uh, measures of objective eye health. So we looked at tear production, we looked at eye moisture, we looked at, we exposed people to a bright light and, and wanted to look at how they recover from that bright light. And what we found was that after six months of supplementation, that people who were given the lutein and zeaxanthin did much better in these objective measures of eye health. They had more natural tear production, they had more moist eyes, they recovered quicker from this bright light. So really positive effects from these objective measures of eye health. Yeah, incredible. I mean, so obviously your advice would be for people to, to supplement these nutrients, is that correct? I mean, what else can people do day to day to protect their eye health? Yeah, I mean, yeah, results are really positive. So we certainly would, uh, you know, this in, provides evidence that a standardised lutein and zeaxanthin supplements can help improve eye health, but it's not a magic pill. I'm not recommending it as a magic pill. Obviously, the first thing we need to do is look at mm. our electronic screen use and what we can do to reduce our use. But then also there's several things that we need to do. We need to make sure that the screens that we're looking at don't have too much glare, that they're in a good position, that we're not bending down and then causing neck strain. Uh, there's a, something called the 20, 20, 20 rule. So basically every 20 minutes, look at something 20 feet away, which is six metres in the metric system for 20 seconds. Uh, we're recommending people blink regularly because that can help natural tear production. And, uh, and obviously getting your eye test uh, once every, every once, uh, once a year, every two years to ensure that your, your eye health is good and you're wearing the proper prescription glasses. Oh, great advice that we can all take on board. Dr Adrian Lepresti, thank you for your time today. Appreciate it. No problem. Thanks for having me.